The Genius Ship, this innovative vessel, is designed to be more efficient, sustainable, and cost-effective than traditional cargo ships. The Genius Ship is the result of years of research and development, and it incorporates cutting-edge technology and design features that set it apart from anything else on the water. The technology behind the ship's design. The hybrid power system allows the ship to be more efficient and reduce its dependence on fossil fuels. One of the key technology behind the ship's design is the use of advanced hull designs that reduce drag and improve the ship's efficiency. This, combined with the ship's advanced navigation and communication systems, allows for improved performance and safety. The ship also features automation and digitalization technologies that can increase operational efficiency and safety. This includes autonomous systems for navigation, cargo handling, and other ship operations. Furthermore, the ship incorporates emission-reducing technologies, such as exhaust cleaning systems and alternative fuel options, to minimize the ship's environmental impact. Overall, the technology behind the Genius ship is designed to improve performance, reduce cost, and minimize the environmental impact of shipping, making it a truly revolutionary concept in the industry. Transportation of cargo across the ocean can be done through various modes, such as shipping, air freight, and rail freight. The most common and cost-effective method is shipping, which uses cargo ships to transport goods. Air freight is faster but more expensive, and rail freight is typically used for goods that require temperature control or are too large for air freight. The choice of transportation method depends on the type of cargo, the time frame for delivery, and the budget for the shipment. In the future, cargo ships are expected to become more efficient and environmentally friendly. One way this could be achieved is through the use of alternative propulsion systems, such as electric or hybrid engines. Another way is through the use of advanced technology, such as digitalization and automation to optimize routes, reduce fuel consumption, and improve logistics. Additionally, some cargo ships are being designed to be more aerodynamic, which can also reduce fuel consumption. Another future trend is the use of larger vessels, known as megaships, which can carry more cargo and improve economies of scale. However, this can also lead to challenges such as port congestion and limitations in terms of the size of ships that can navigate certain waterways. Another trend is the use of drones and autonomous ships for cargo transportation, which can also help to improve efficiency, reduce costs, and minimize human errors. Cargo ships that are remotely controlled by humans also known as remotely operated vessels, ROVs, or autonomous ships, are a rapidly developing technology in the maritime industry. These ships are operated by a human crew remotely, typically from a control center on shore or a nearby support vessel. This allows for greater efficiency and cost savings by reducing the need for a crew on board the ship. The use of remote control technology in cargo ships allows for improved safety, as the crew is not on board the vessel and therefore not at risk of injury or death in the event of an accident. Additionally, ROVs can be operated 24-7, which can increase the efficiency and productivity of the vessel. However, there are also some challenges to the implementation of ROVs in cargo ships. One of the main challenges is the need for reliable communication systems and a secure data link between the ship and the control center. Another challenge is the need for high level of expertise and training for the remote operators to ensure they can safely and effectively control the vessel. The first autonomous shipping vessels in the world. The Yara Birkeland, developed by Norwegian firm Yara International, which is considered as the first fully electric and autonomous container ship in the world. It was launched in 2018 and began its first voyage on Norway's coast in 2019. The Mayflower, developed by ProMare and IBM, which is the world's first autonomous vessel to cross the Atlantic Ocean. The ship completed the journey in September 2020, retracing the route of the original Mayflower in 1620. The Avenger, developed by Rolls-Royce, which is a prototype of an autonomous cargo ship that can be remotely controlled from a control center on shore. The ship was tested in 2018 in the waters off the coast of Norway. The Sea Hunter, developed by the U.S. Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA, which is a 332-foot-long autonomous service vessel. ASV, that can travel thousands of miles without a crew. It was launched in 2016 and completed its first open water trial in 2017. Future Ships That Run on Sun 
In the future, ships that run on solar power have the potential to revolutionize the maritime industry by reducing the reliance on fossil fuels and decreasing greenhouse gas emissions. The concept of solar-powered ships has been around for several decades, but it has been challenging to develop a practical and efficient design. Currently, the most common approach is to use solar panels to generate electricity to power electric propulsion systems, which can be used in combination with other power sources like batteries, wind, or hydrogen fuel cells. Several companies and research institutions have developed and tested prototypes of solar-powered ships, such as the Planet Solar is the largest solar-powered boat in the world. It was launched in 2010 and completed a journey around the world in 2012. The Solar Wave, developed by the Austrian company Solar Wave, which is a series of solar-powered catamaran passenger ships, the first of which was launched in 2017. The MS Turner, Planet Solar, developed by the Swiss company Planet Solar, which is the world's largest solar-powered ship and was launched in 2010. The MS Turner, developed by the German company Beluga, which is a solar-powered cargo ship that was launched in 2018. These are just a few examples of solar-powered ships that have been developed, and as the technology of solar panels, batteries, and other components improve, it is expected that more solar-powered ships will be developed in the future. The role of government and industry in the development of implementation of the ship. From an industry perspective, the shipping companies and shipbuilders have a crucial role in the development and implementation of the ship. They have the expertise and resources to design, build, and operate the ship, and they also bear the financial risks associated with it. The shipping industry also plays an important role in shaping the future of the sector by investing in research and development and by testing and validating new technologies and designs. The genius ships developed in implementation require a strong partnership between government and industry as well as a shared commitment to sustainability, innovation, and safety. This partnership will help to overcome the challenges and limitations of the ship's development and implementation, and ultimately make this ship a reality. Are you enjoying our video? Before we get further, please like this video and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on more amazing videos from us. Let's continue to explore the genius ships. Crucial trends and challenges for the future of shipping. The geoeconomic outlook and shipping trades and patterns are closely linked, as global economic conditions and trade patterns can greatly impact the demand for shipping services and the routes that ships take. A strong global economy typically leads to an increase in international trade, which in turn increases the demand for shipping services. This can lead to higher freight rates and increased activity at ports and other shipping hubs, which can result in lower freight rates and reduce activity in the shipping industry. The pattern of trade flows also has an impact on the shipping industry. As global trade patterns shift, shipping routes and the types of ships used to transport goods may also change. Geopolitical issues can also affect the shipping industry. For example, sanctions, tariffs, and trade disputes can disrupt trade routes and create uncertainty for shipping companies. Additionally, the ongoing global pandemic and the lockdowns had a significant impact on the shipping industry as it slowed down the movement of goods and reduced the demand for shipping services. Hydrogen economy for greener transport ships. The hydrogen economy is a concept that envisions the use of hydrogen as a primary energy source to power vehicles, buildings, and other forms of transportation, including ships. The use of hydrogen in shipping has the potential to greatly reduce the environmental impact of the industry, as hydrogen fuel cells produce only water as a byproduct. Unlike traditional fossil fuels, which produce pollutants and greenhouse gas emissions, hydrogen fuel cells work by converting the chemical energy of hydrogen into electricity, which can be used to power electric propulsion systems on ships. Hydrogen can be produced from various sources, such as natural gas, biogas, and renewable energy sources like wind and solar panel. Overall, the future ships may have the following characteristics, such as it gets automated and connected, allowing for greater efficiency and cost savings. Automation technologies such as self-navigating systems and remote-controlled cargo handling could reduce the need for crew, while digital systems such as IoT, blockchain, and AI will help optimize operations and improve communication and data management. Also, it becomes more dependent on renewable energy sources such as solar, wind, and hydrogen to power propulsion systems and onboard services. Design and operational charges will be implemented to reduce fuel consumption 
emissions, and increase energy efficiency. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Let us know in the comments that you're subscribed and what you think of this video. We will reply to you personally. You can also give a thumbs up. Thanks for that.